Hey guys, it's Back of the Bargainer back with a lipstick video. I have several lipsticks that I wanted to show you today and I'm going to try them on for you. These are some of my favorite lipsticks. Now I don't collect tons and tons of lipsticks. I pulled out my favorite ones that I have and I thought I would just show you guys. A lot of them are bold and ones that I'm trying to use more because I used to tend to do more brown and just, you know, neutral lipsticks. So I'm trying to like break out and do some Anyway, fun what I'm wearing so. today is the Milani Power Lip and it is in Creamy Cafe. I did get this at Dollar Tree for $1. You can get it at uh, Walgreens, some of the different places there, uh, pharmacies and things for like $6.98, I think is the normal price. So this is a really nice lipstick and um, the thing about these Power Lips is that it is a gloss stain, so it is a shiny finish. I really like this color. It's my favorite of all the Power Lips that I've purchased and um, yeah, so that's the first one that I really enjoy. The second one on my hand right here, that's the one right there. So I do have a lot of bold lip to show you today. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you one at a time. So thank you for watching guys. I hope you enjoy this video. And uh, just a disclaimer, I'm not um, sponsored by any of these brands. I am just having fun today showing you some of my favorite lipsticks, some lipsticks that I bought and I didn't really like at first, but I've learned to like uh, and learned to love. So thank you guys so the much for watching. The next lipstick is from Dollar Tree. It is the LA Colors lipstick brand and it has like a nice white tube here. It's a really pretty pink, like darker pink color. And I am wearing that on the lips today. I, I would never ever wear this color ever before I started shopping at Dollar Tree. I just kind of, I don't know, breaking out of my shell here. So this one I really like. It feels very moisturizing. And this is the color right here on my hand. So this is the color right here. So this was the first one. That was the second one. Some of these are similar, but they are different enough to point out. And for a dollar, this is a nice brand at and Dollar Tree. I'm using these uh, green tea cleansing tissues. They're from Big Lots to take off the lipstick. And my lips already feel really dry. So <laughs> by the end of the night, it should be falling off. The next one I'm going to try is one I just picked up. It is a L'Oreal Color Riche and Raisin Rapture. And this is such a beautiful color. This is my newest lipstick. I wanted to get, and I got this for my birthday, I just picked out a new lipstick and I just love the packaging on it and so I'm just going to show you what this looks like on, okay? I think this is my favorite one out of all the lipsticks I'm showing you today. It's just the prettiest color. On my hand, it's the last one here on the end. I really like this one. I did put like two coats of this lipstick on and I just love it. It's one of the prettiest ones that I have in my collection. I thought I would just share it with you today. If you ever are wanting a lipstick, it's, it's pretty reasonable. I got it for $5.96. The next lipstick is a Wet n Wild Fergie line, and I just picked this up at Dollar Tree, so only spent a dollar on this one. This is probably my one of my favorite ones, and it's so moisturizing. When I put this on my lip, it feels so good, and it feels a little bit cooling. So this one is really nice. I like the purple color. This is the color Ferguson Crest Cabernet, and um, yeah, this is a really nice one for a dollar. I picked it up, and... It is this color on my hand right there. So the next lipstick is a Ramel London lipstick, which they all, to me, they taste like cinnamon. I love this line of lipsticks. And look how far down it is. I'm pretty sad. I definitely am gonna buy this one again. This is called Bordeaux, and it's one of my favorite ones. Right now it's the darkest lipstick that I have, but I really am enjoying it. So, and of course it's right here on my hand. So the next one is a Milani Power Lip called Red Control in number one. Now, I'm not a huge fan of these power lips because they are not really a lipstick. It's a, a gloss stain, but I do, this is the only red color of lipstick I have, and I need your opinion because I'm not sure if it's the right color. I feel like it's not, like with this shirt, I don't even know. It's my only red shirt that I have too, so if this color, hmm, I just don't know if it's right with my coloring, but yeah, it's a pretty bold lipstick and I'll probably use it at Christmas time 
and wear it then, but really not my favorite color to wear, only because I'm still uncomfortable wearing red. Let me know in the comments if this red is right for me. I would appreciate it. lipstick I wanted to show you today is a beautiful lipstick this is the one that I regretted buying at one point but I like it now and I know it doesn't go with what I'm wearing necessarily but it's this color right here on my hand and I just was wearing the red control which is right here but anyway this lipstick I bought and it's from the Kate line Rimmel London I thought I would get it this is like the first bold lip I, I bought and I was like could not believe that I spent the money for it. it wasn't it was probably like six dollars but anyway I I now feel comfortable wearing colors like this and it's one of my favorite ones to wear now Rosetto this is the color Rosetto so I do recommend this color and I love like I said before I love the Rimmel London lipsticks they're really really nice so those are some of my favorite lipsticks right now both drugstore and bargain lipsticks. I do have more lipsticks that I can show you, but those are my favorite right now. And yes, they are kind of a mixture, but I think you could get away with wearing all of these in the fall, especially if you wear neutral colors, you know, like brown or neutral fall colors. Um, you could definitely wear these with a fall outfit. So anyway, thought I would share them with you today. Hope you guys are doing well, and I thank you for watching my video today. Take care, guys.